This morning, I instructed my office to dismiss the criminal case against Adnan Saeed following the completion of a second round of touch DNA testing of items that were never tested before. Those items include skirt, pantyhose, shoes, and jacket of Miss Hey Min Lee. My office received notice of these results on Friday. This morning, I personally reached out to the victim's attorney to inform Miss Lee's family of the DNA findings and my decision to dismiss the case. We attempted to wait for confirmation of notice before releasing anything publicly, but we still, at this point, have not heard back from that attorney. Equally heartbreaking is the pain and the sacrifice and the trauma that has been imposed not just on that family, but Adnan and his family, who together spent 23 years in prison for a crime as a result of a wrongful conviction. Although my administration was not responsible for neither the pain inflicted upon Heyman Lee's family, nor was my administration responsible for the wrongful conviction of Mr. Saeed, as a representative of the institution, it is my responsibility to acknowledge and to apologize to the family of Heyman Lee and Adnan Saeed. As the administrator of the criminal justice system, it's my duty to ensure that justice is not delayed, justice is never denied, but justice be done. Today, justice is done. And that means today, tomorrow, and until my administration ends, we will continue to utilize every available resource to prosecute whoever is responsible for the death of Hey Min Lee.